Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, well I was uh, showing how to actually use active hours within Windows 10 to prevent unexpected Windows updates maybe during a meeting or a gaming session or so on. Uh, the same, f Of course the same feature is available in Windows 11 it's just buried down a little further uh, which is weird because a lot of the settings in Windows 11 are actually a little more logical in general but uh, they decided to group them in, uh, in the more advanced options, basically. So, active hours is a way to tell your computer not to restart or do anything special with Windows updates while it is being used. Um, and, of course, that is very useful if you're afraid that something can happen. How many times people have told you, or maybe you've lived through it, Windows Update popped up. I'm restarting now to install updates. So right click on the Start button. Go into Settings. There you will go into the Windows Update tab on the left. Now in here, if you remember, Windows 10 had the option directly here. Um, and that was easy to find. But in Windows 11, it's in the Advanced options that you have to go. In the advanced options, you'll see active hours. Now you see here, 10 a.m. to 2 a.m. is mine. This is pretty typically my gaming machine because I know that I might be gaming anywhere. First of all, from 10 a.m., I'm going to start working, do YouTube videos, do all sorts of things. But, you know, at night, I might be watching videos or Netflix or whatever. And, of course, I might be gaming. So if uh, I game up to midnight, one hour in the morning, at least it's there to prevent the update. So you click there. And if it, the time set by default is not the one you want, simply click on it. You have adjust active hours. Here it's automatic. So it kind of tells me that the computer learned that this is the time for me to use a PC and maybe not to bother me and do anything. But you can click automatically set it manually and here you'll see the uh, start time set time that you can actually put remember that you have a maximum of 18 hours in difference because it, the computer will want to set at least six hours of time for a possible windows update and a restart so you just set it manually like this and as you've seen mine has kind of learned pretty much automatically that 10 a.m to 2 to 2 a.m. is really the time not to bother my PC usage. So it's up to you to check that out. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.